Why the difference between the reliability of percentages in a polygraph test? It's quite common when you look up information about the reliability of a polygraph test that you have contradictory percentages. Some might say it's 50%, others say it's 100%. There's not very logic, but actually there is an explanation for that. You know, the percentages or the differences in percentages basically uh, refer to the element that people are talking about. Let me explain. Now, in a polygraph test, we have two different elements. On one side, we have a polygraph instrument. And on the other side, the use of that polygraph instrument to perform a polygraph test. Now, the polygraph instrument, if everything is working fine, we can basically trust the readings of that polygraph. It will register the physiological activity of the person examined. We can basically say that the polygraph will, for 100%, measure, register the physiological activity of that person. The variables that influence the reliability of an instrument are, among others, a good functioning instrument and components. The right premises, you have to do the test under the right conditions. An experienced technician and a physically and mentally fit examinee. Sometimes it is possible that you get, uh, let's say, weaker reading because you have an examinee that might be taking some medications that will influence its nervous system or he might be tired or the person just has naturally less physiological response. Also, there might be some distractions that might distort the readings of the polygraph. However, to say that the polygraph will register false physiological activity is very, very unlikely. So we can say that if the instrument is working fine, we're working in the right conditions, the readings of the instrument are almost perfect, almost 100%. Now, when we talk about the reliability of a polygraph test, let's say the percentage of validity we can give when we say in a polygraph test that the person is lying or telling the truth, well, that percentage will be affected. Why is that percentage different from the polygraph instrument? Well, because other variables will enter the equation and therefore influence the margin of error. Now these variables are the correct interpretation of the issue under investigation by the examiner, the intellectual capacity of the examinee, emotional state and maturity of the examinee, the use of the proper techniques for the different issues that might be under investigation by the examiner, and finally, the correct interpretation by the examiner of the registered physiological activity of the examinee. However, when we talk about the reliability of a polygraph test, the only percentage that we actually can use are the ones that have been proven, be it by laboratory studies or field studies. Those are the only guarantors of a real reliability, of a real tested and validated reliability. The current studies of, of the different techniques used and validated by the American Polygraph Association point to success rates between 86 to 91 percent when we use techniques for the detection of deception. So in summary we can say that the reliability of a polygraph instrument is between 99.9 .9 to 100 percent and the reliability of the polygraph test depends on the technique that we use and for the detection of deception right now it's between 86 to 91 percent okay i hope this answered your question but if you, if you have another question or you have another doubt why don't you visit or look or take a look at the other videos we have on this playlist that might actually answer 
maybe another doubt, another question you might have. And if not, if you can't find the answer to your question, please send us an email and we will reply to you as soon as we can. Just a little message before you go and watch some other video. If you want to be updated about our most recent videos we upload, the questions we answer, or the opinions we might have about our industry, subscribe and you will be the first one to be informed about our latest videos, our most recent opinion. Subscribe. Have you? Okay. Well, don't lie to me. Don't lie to me. Should I take out the polygraph? Oh, okay. Okay. Subscribe.